USF had one spring practice before the pandemic put the brakes on college football. But today the Bulls are back on the field for the first time in five months. And this time they want to stay there. ABC Action News sports anchor Kevin Lewis has more from the practice field. First year head coach Jeff Scott said he set his alarm for five o'clock this morning, but was so excited he woke up at four. He decided to get an early start on the day because it had been 150 days since his first and only practice as USF head coach. I was excited just to see the smile on their face, to see them with a helmet on and over there having fun. Like that to me was more important than any of the, the X and O's and execution and all that. As of right now, the season opener is at Texas September 5th. And the Bulls know being smart and safe is one of the best ways to make that happen. The players are being responsible, wearing their masks, keeping being distant from each other. You, you catch the virus or something, you're out for 14 days. You know, that's two games right there. So that's not something you got to we're in football season, so you got to be focused on that goal and you just got to be smart about everything you do. If college football had to pivot again and move games to spring, well, Coach Scott said he would give us his best canned answer. As soon as we can play safely and healthy and keep everybody healthy, that's when we want to play. I think we've been very fortunate again with USF Health in our backyard to really uh, be able to stay on, on top of, of all the things going on and, and let our guys uh, know that we're going to do everything we can to, to keep them healthy and safe. Coach Scott said there were 514 coronavirus tests given over the past two and a half months, and currently there are zero positives and no players in quarantine. At USF, I'm Kevin Lewis, ABC Action News.